Good morning, everyone. So, last night, I was at the gym, and I don't know if I've injured my quad muscle or not. I was basically doing an exercise, and it felt like it didn't like something, so I pretty much immediately stopped and came home and iced it. I've been walking around fine. It doesn't feel like there's any pain or anything there. Uh, but it does scare me a bit. And yeah, uh, I've got a run today. I'm going to very slowly warm up. And I might even just do a lap of the court before I even go any further than that. Uh, today's run's supposed to be 12Ks again. Six kilometers at a half tempo pace and I think it was same 510 per K and then the last 6 K is to be running at 430 which is I know I've run like a 21 minute park run recently but it's like 430 is pretty fast still for me I haven't broken the mental barrier for that pace yet um so it is concerning. I'm just going to see what I can do. If I feel like there's anything that's going to impact it, I'm just going to stop. So I think that's more my accountability for today. But as I turn the phone on, I got 555. And for those that don't know, I don't mind having a look at the angel numbers. So when you see like 111, 222, or whatever, all the way up to... Well, 999 or zero 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 depending which way you want to go um they all mean something different so i had to have a look again because i can't remember what they are and it goes what does the angel number 555 mean in numerology 555 is considered to be an angel number that is said to represent change good luck i should just say good luck Transformation, freedom, and personal growth. Numerology is the study of numbers coupled with a belief that numbers have a significance in people's lives and can be omens of the future. <sighs> Did have a lot on my mind last night though, so I think I'm coming to some conclusions and we'll just see where that brings me. Anyway, I'm going to have another pre-workout, <laughs> which I probably shouldn't. It's going to be my last one for the week, that's for sure, I think. But it will at least help get blood flow going, which is what the quad would need if there is anything wrong. And I'm not going to start running in five minutes like I did yesterday. I might wait until about 6.30 and then see how I go from there. Anyway, you guys have an awesome day. Bye.